Okay. You seem excited. Mm -hmm, I am. Mm. So who asked who again? You ask me. Oh, okay, right, okay. you ask me. Thank you for saying yes. All right. All right. Ooh, that's mine. I call dibs. Look at yours. Mm. Yes. <laughs> How would you describe the perfect date? Perfect date? Yeah, definitely this, right? Um, <laughs> I don't really know, like anything with a nice atmosphere and so on. So definitely right this, right? The right person? Oh, so definitely this, right? Uh -huh, yeah, there okay, you if you want to put it that way. Yeah, sure. Am I supposed to like... No, I have to answer too, right? Oh. Mm -hmm, all right, okay. For me, I think a good date is when you have someone you can vibe with mm -hmm. and laugh. and. I don't know, have a good conversation. Okay. <laughs> Name three things that you have in common with me, I think. I think so. Um, mm -hmm. Let's see. I think we're both pretty <laughs> inside. Nope, oh. not me. Uh, sure, I think the you. viewers can see perfectly fine. And other than that, I think we're both a bit of an old soul. A bit. Okay, a I bit. guess. A bit. And you look like you like Star Wars. A lot. There we go. Yes, very much. Mm. If you could change one thing about yourself, what would it be? One thing. Probably nothing. Okay, okay. Maybe height. If I could change my height. You want to be shorter? Sh taller. Oh, okay, okay. Taller. Okay, if there's one thing that you want to change, that you want to change about yourself, what would it be? My passport. My passport is garbage. <laughs> okay. Right. So that's okay, definitely something I was something not I want to expecting that. What's your best memory and what's your worst? Ooh, okay. Okay, I'll start with my worst. For me, I guess my worst is when my maternal grandfather, he had his uh, surgery for his brain and what happened was right after that he started to decline rapidly and the reason why it's the, my worst memory one of my worst is because it's someone I look up to he started from nothing and he built everything up from there and I think he's one of the only strong male role models I have in my life that's my best memory realizing how free I was after a very toxic breakup yeah Worst memory is probably the time when I was like doing my diploma, I guess, because it's pretty, you know, like it's pretty messed up, and I was like in a really dark phase of my life. But still, well, at least one good memory, right? At least one good memory. Well, it has to be the time spent with my family, I guess. All right, that's respectable. Mm -hmm. If you could look into the future right now. What would you want to know? My future husband. <laughs> what? But a preview of my future family and what it's going to be. All right. Probably. What about you? I want to know if I made it and made it in the sense that did I do right by my family? Mm -hmm. Like my own fam personal, like my future family, my wife and kids. See if I made it and I, did, and I showed them justice. Share three positive things about yourself. Three positive. I'm very loyal. Mm -hmm. it's, it's a fact. Is he though? Another positive thing. When I'm fixated on something and I really want it done, I'll get it done no matter what. Nothing can stop me. Okay. I won't take no for an answer mm -hmm. in that sense. <laughs> and what else? I'm stubborn. And I think that's positive. Because my stubbornness has done a lot for me in my life. Okay. Fair enough. 
three positive, <clears throat> positive things about myself would be my personality, I guess. <laughs> I'm cute. Okay. Yeah, I mean, I'm nice. I guess you can put it that way. And um, I care a lot for like the people that I care about. Okay. And I like outdoor stuff. All right. What if anything? Okay, ask your partner. What if anything is too serious to joke about? A relationship, like, like if you were to like joke about you cheating on me with someone that, that's a no no, I guess. Do you get what I mean? For me, I think joking about someone's physical appearance, because oh, when you okay, consistently that's like say, mean. I mean, because I know a lot of people who do that, and I've gone through that myself when I used to be like severely overweight and this sits in the back of your mind especially when it comes Wait, from your family Wait, do you have family. like a photo or something that you can show? Like show You want to see everyone? a photo? Sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah I'll show you a photo Yeah Oh my god! Are you for real? Can I like scroll? Oh. Damn Okay nobody coming near us Ain't no limit where we're going now I got women always showing now on the view in any Judas loop and make a missing ain't nobody kissing now Young when I young sin a pizza when I'm down then I head spin I cash when I brother I'm the bread when I bread but I wrong got a you and be the soul son I don't grab a weapon up and I'm so they never bubble a world Set number three If you are dying with no chance to talk to anyone what would you regret not having told someone and why haven't you told them? Hmm for me I think it's telling my mom that I love her I don't tell her that much it's mm. and I, the reason why I don't tell her enough is because I've had a troubled past, like growing up, mm -hmm. and it had friction between me and my mom. But I mm -hmm. love her. But you know, sometimes when you're in too much proximity with someone, it's a bit toxic because of the things that happened previously mm -hmm. growing up. But yeah, but these days I do focus more on telling her that I love her more, because without her, I wouldn't have anything much, honestly. She's the biggest supporter I have. Probably the same as your case, but in my case, it would be like both of my parents because I don't really tell them I love them a lot. And then like, you know, sometimes it's hard for, for us like to just tell them in the face that we, we love them because it's like so weird because weird. we don't do it very often. It's that phase, I guess, so. of life. Uh, share a personal problem and ask your partner's advice on how he or she might handle it. All right, I think a problem that I have is that I take on too much workload and I spread myself thin way too much. Like in every phase of my life, for example, university, right? Every semester I'm like, okay, this semester I'm going to do nothing. And guess what happens? I do everything. I tell you to take out way too much. And yeah, how would you advise, give what advice would you give me? Teamwork. With who? <laughs> With your friends. Sometimes there's no teamwork in the work, right? Sometimes it's an individual task that you pick up. Mm -hmm, I guess, thing. time management, I guess. Mine would be, um, I don't know, I get jealous pretty easily. Does it make any sense? Yeah. And I get insecure most of the time, when I'm, even with um, even if I'm like just with my friends and so on. I would just say keep busy, do your thing. Why would you want to compare yourself to someone else? Mm -hmm. And why would you want to see like if you're, if you're in your partnership, let's say with your boyfriend, or whatever, right? You're supposed to trust him. If he messes up, he messes up, and you ditch. Yeah. And mm -hmm. same way back and forth. So I think that's it. Just keep your to yourself. Mm -hmm. So I think last question we played for it, right? Okay. You know how to play rock, paper, scissors, right? Mm -hmm. Alright. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Okay, I win. Okay. Hmm. Ask the nice question, please. A nice? Mm -hmm. Alright. In Star Wars, who would you no, rather... No, don't make me choose! In Star Wars, no. who would you rather kill? Darth Vader or Kylo Ren? Can I, like, choose not to answer this question? No, you have to answer it. Kylo Ren. Oh my god, I can't believe I'm saying this. Good choice. <laughs> yeah, I He's hate you for this though, like seriously, I hate you for this. Can I eat? I'm hungry, I'm starving. <laughs> <Big. laughs> You're supposed to eat in between. I'm worried there's gonna be like stuff stuck on my teeth. <laughs> That's a given. <laughs> We're gonna zoom into it for the meeting. She signed the waiver already. <laughs> uh. Mm-hmm. Yep. Yeah, what do you think I feel about my problem? You've chosen. Wait, what? What were you saying? 
I'm so sorry. What? 